In this video, I'm sharing seven, count them, seven reasons why the Elgato Wave XLR may be the best audio interface you can get for live streaming. Hey there, Kevin Colby here, helping you do more with video. When it comes to mics, especially mics for live streaming, or maybe just like an in-studio office production like I have here, you have two mics, basically two mics. You have a USB, and you have an XLR. Now USB mics are really good mics and they are super easy because literally you just plug them right into your computer, there's no extra hardware and you're off and running. An XLR mic is a little better mic and it takes a little bit more hardware to get working. They could be more expensive, not only the mics, but then you have the audio interfaces and all this other extra stuff to buy and they could be huge and complicated. Until now, the Elgato Wave XLR has really changed all of that and let me tell you the seven reasons I think it may be the best audio interface for live streaming and speaking of live streaming this video is sponsored by StreamYard which is the absolute easiest way to live stream look if you've never tried StreamYard there's a link down in the description give it a shot today you can try it out for free and you'll see just how easy it is to live stream with StreamYard number one the simple design you're not gonna get a ton of bells and whistles on the Elgato Wave XLR, but that's cool. It does what it needs to, and it's in a very small little box-like type thing that sits on your desk, doesn't take up a lot of space. Number two, it's power. You see, there's no AC adapter you need for the Elgato Wave XLR. So you literally will power it via your computer, or in my case, the Cal Digit Hub it's going into. Number three, it's simple to set up. I mean, there literally is not much you do. You take it out of the box, you plug it in, you plug in the mic, and you're ready to go. Number four, one button controls everything. Yeah, there is one huge knob on there, which kind of looks cool, that controls your mic volume, your headset, your headphone volume, the mix between your headphone and your mic and the computer, and even whether you have phantom power on or off. One button does it all. One tap mute. Now, what do I mean by that? Th to me, this is almost the reason to buy it. Literally, if you tap the back of the Elgato Wave XLR, it says mute if you, you look at it, it immediately mutes your mic, which makes it so easy when you're in the middle of a live stream. If you just need to reach over, tap it, it mutes it, you untap it. And the way you know it's muted is because the white ring lights that go around the knob will go red, which visually now you know your mic is muted. Number six, it comes with the cord you need. It actually is a USB-C cord, which is a really great cord. And again, all you have to do is plug it into the back of the Elgato Wave XLR, into your computer or your dock, the CalDigit again is what I'm using, and it works. Number seven, it works with the free Elgato Wavelink software. This is a free app that you can download, and I'd highly recommend it because it unlocks even more potential of not only the audio interface, but the mics that you have plugged into it. So you think of it as getting more more out of your mics and more out of the interface and and it's free so why not use it now audio interfaces can range all over the place on price from like really cheap to like crazy expensive the Ogata Wave XLR comes in at around 159 you know it's moderate but you get a ton of features for that one price. So if you're looking for an audio interface, you wanna step up your live streaming game or maybe your in-studio production, I highly recommend you take a look at the Elgato Wave XLR. There's a link down in the description. You can check it out for yourself. Hey, if you like this, consider subscribing to the channel, giving it a like too. I'm Kevin Colby. Keep using your gifts and I'll see you in the next video.